Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video. Hope you've had a lovely weekend and ready to start a brand new week. So today we're just gonna test out something really simple. We're testing out uh, the eye chrome from Makeup Revolution. I bought this um, a few weeks ago and I did this in, I showed this in my um, makeup haul. I got the shade Adore. So basically you, on one side you have a matte red and then on the other side you have a chrome red. Um, I've never tried this before. I don't know what it's going to look like. It could look completely rubbish on me or it could look quite nice. We will see. So surprise, surprise. I chose the red colour because... You know, I've never tried the red colour on this channel before, so I thought I would just give this a go today. Um, I haven't actually watched any videos on how it works. I probably should have done that first, but I was a bit stupid and I thought, you know what, let's just go like in, like, you know, not blinded, but just kind of like, I have an idea on how I want to do it. Um, I've got some different brushes with me, but always I want to just do my base first. And then I'll be putting these on the eyes afterwards. Um, right, so priming is the way to go first. So have you had a nice weekend? What did you guys get up to? I was working all weekend. Um, even, and the weather was just completely just strange. Like one minute it was super sunny. And the next minute it was raining. And, you know, when it comes to like London weather, you always have to be prepared for it to rain it could be in the middle of summer and it will rain <laughs> it's just completely ridiculous um and yeah yesterday was international women's day which is amazing uh, when i was at work there was like a massive protest outside i don't know if you would call it a protest it's more of a kind of march um and that was fantastic they were just like cheering really loudly and everyone was like singing and letting off like pink flares. I don't know if that's, I mean, it smelled really bad. Um, those kind of flares are not really, <laughs> I don't know if they're kind of safe and breathable, but it was fine. They were having a good time. Everyone was safe in that aspect. Um, but it was nice. And also like it was, it's gonna sound really corny, but me and my husband really love watching um, Mortal Kombat tournaments. It was the last one last night and we managed to, well, so I got home about half four, almost five and it had already started and there were a couple of players that we both really love were playing um, and essentially this was like the last one of this year. So it was quite interesting to see some of the players again. This is probably not interesting to any of you at all, but it's just something that we did over the weekend, which was quite nice because we always end up just watching YouTube or just eating random food, which was basically what we kind of did anyway. Um, but I thought, you know, something like the tournament will mix it up just a little bit. And I've just remembered that I have forgotten my mirror. So surprise, surprise, I will, I'm gonna honestly try my best with this eye chrome because it, it could look a mess, but then hopefully, it won't because <laughs> I will hope because I've got these kind of like brushes with me that will be kind of you know I'm gonna like do a bit of an eye outline first and then go from there I'm just gonna add a bit of concealer because my face is looking a little bit sad today I don't know why my spots are not my friend so we've got a few here got some from the bags even though I had a, quite a nice sleep, but no, one, you know, sleep is never enough. You can never get enough sleep. One, I kind of feel like I um, could be like Sleepy Beauty and, you know, just sleep for about, you know, God knows how many years. And then my husband can come and wake me up. <laughs> you know, that's the dream. Every girl has a dream to be a Disney princess. Mine is to be Sleeping Beauty because you get to sleep. You know, you you know, you might have a big curse on you, but that's fine. It's nothing, it's nothing too crazy. All right, so powder down as per usual with my revolution. Again, these are my favourites. I will maybe when I get paid again, I'll do like another mini haul. I do need to kind of sort out my collection because it's getting a little bit a bit full for my box. So if you guys want me to do 
um, like a kind of show you what I have, what they kind of call them, I know, but like a declutter or just kind of show you the palace that I have and I could probably do like a poll to see if anyone wants to see any specific palettes or any kind of looks or anything. I'm trying to kind of be still be a bit more imaginative on this channel. I know everything so far is oh, I'm testing out this new item and la la la, but that's what I kind of want to do with this channel. I just want to kind of just just yeah, each each video has to be something different and obviously that doesn't help if I'm using the same products again and again because again I'm using my wet and mild highlighter which is you know one of my favorites and it always will be um and yeah I, I do need to like mix things up a bit and I need to kind of have a look um into like getting a couple of more different brands instead of just like today we're doing revolution again today we're doing this again one day I promise we'll do something different um but first let's try this eye chrome and I'm gonna do some swatches for you guys first just to see how it looks and it looks so it looks runny but okay let's do but apparently this dries down quite matte so I'm gonna yeah so you can see straight away this is obviously the matte side and then I'm not going to put it on top, I'm going to put it onto the side to see what the chrome looks like because I actually even haven't swatched these since I purchased them. All I did was just open the packet. Oh, very nice. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Um, so basically I'm going to be looking quite over the top today. That's, that's just good. I like it. So yeah, you've got the matte side. It still takes a bit of time for it to dry down. That's okay. And then I've got the chrome side here as well beautiful reflections let's let's give it a go I don't know if I should oh, I'm just trying to figure out how the best way to do it because I've seen a few looks online where they have like quite minimalist and because my my eyelids are quite hooded if I when I open my eyelids you barely see anything so if I do something quite high up that might be something a bit easier but you know what would have been easier if I put my mirror down <laughs> but you know that's just how life goes um yeah, I'm just gonna oh, wish me luck, guys. Um, just gonna, yeah, go for it because we've got nothing to lose. Right. What I might do is put it on a brush first. I might try one on each side. No, that's my other brush. So, just gonna get one of my. Oh, that's from Revolution as well. Brush from Revolution, and we are just going to. We're just gonna go for it. Right. Let's go. Okay, so essentially it looks like a paint. I'm like painting my eye, <laughs> but this is this is cool. So far, so good. I didn't actually put that much on. Um, I should have probably put on a bit more. I will build this up. Um, but so far, it's looking quite pigmented. That's nice. Okay. Um. Yeah, I mean, essentially, I know that this is just like a standard eyeshadow, um, but it's just in liquid form. And to be honest, I've never really used liquid eyeshadow before. So everything has been kind of um, like powder, obviously. Um, and I'm really intrigued to try um, the Wet and Mild Jelly um, eyeshadows. I haven't seen any like reviews on those, so I might have a look and see if um, they're good. Um, this is all right. I'm going to have to clean this up in a second, but I'm, on the other side, I'm going to go in with the applicator um, just because it could be something a bit different. Right. Let's let's have a go. Oh, all right. I'm just scared because if I mess this up, I'm going to have to take off my makeup and do it all again. <laughs> and I don't really think I have time for that. OK, so it's definitely more pigmented in when you use the applicator. Okay, that's a bit, yeah, I might have to touch it up on the other side. I'm going to do a bit of a wing look because we are going all out today, guys. Let's just do it. We're working late and we're going to stand out. That's all good. Okay. Oh, that's nice. Quite like that. That's, um, oh, I don't want to melt. <laughs> I was so close to messing that up. Okay. This is... 
Oh, oh no. Right, so what essentially I want to do is let that dry first and then I will add the chrome on top. Okay, so yeah, that's nice. What I'm going to do is just touch up this side. Um, yeah, I mean, even I think using the applicator is probably going to be more beneficial. Um, I'm just going to touch up here just so I don't, you know, it looks nice on one side and doesn't on the other side because that's not. That's not me. We need to look like we need to look nice on both sides. How does that look? Weird, yeah, but we're gonna go for it. Oh no, okay. Yes, we are looking crazy. I love it. Kind of going for a bit of a gaga vibe, but yeah, that's fine. I mean, I'm gonna tidy it up when I um finally have a mirror because that means. I can actually make them look symmetrical. I can hope. I hope I can. Um, but yeah, that is kind of drying down. It's still a bit wet. But I will add the chrome side in just a second. I think I'm gonna let that dry first. But then let me just put on my lipstick because I think in that time it'll be fine. I wore this lipstick yesterday and I got a couple of compliments. So this is awesome. It's the um, LA Splash Classic Horror in the shade Frankenstein. Not Frankenstein's monster, just Frankenstein. So um, maybe it's just about the doctor. I don't know. Um, <laughs> but I really love these lipsticks. Um, I reviewed the palette um, at, well, at, you know, at the beginning of my channel, a couple of videos in about how much I love it. And then obviously the lipsticks as well. Their shades are so nice they've got a, a really crazy amount of shades so we've got our reds we've got some purples we've even got a gray that i purchased and i've only worn that like once or twice but i might have to do a look for you guys and wear that as well because it is a nice color um i don't know if i should use it as kind of like you know something in the middle of like a nice shade but we will do some experimenting one day but with this one it's just gorgeous pigmented and yeah just really nice so like i said i'm going for a red look today this is perfect so excuse me while i put this on and again no mirror so we are just we're just going for it oh dear life is so difficult without a mirror <laughs> Okay, excellent. And then I kind of feel like the mat is quite drying because I can feel it on my eyelids. It's getting a bit um, kind of tougher, <laughs> and that's quite weird. You're like, oh, it feels quite tough to like close my eyes, but when the mat is drying down, you can actually feel it. Um, let me get the chrome, and then we're gonna probably go in the. Um, just on the eyelid so as you can see on here the chrome has like really dried down so that is what we want for the eyes because we don't want to go completely crazy right let's go oh yes we are shining yes okay so that's just going to go on the lid only basically that's not really going to go anywhere else gonna have to dip in again Hope you guys can see it. I can kind of, yeah, that's looking really gorgeous. Wow. So this is this kind of look is you know if I'm going to a wedding or if I'm going to work, <laughs> you know, <laughs> just something not so extravagant. Um, but what I might do um, when I actually I might just might as well just do it now for you guys. I'm gonna tidy up the corners just here because I you know I want to look semi-professional for you guys when I'm like taking the thumbnail because <laughs> even though I do look completely crazy today I want to actually um, look nice when I'm going to work because you know I need to look nice and professional so this oh yeah the concealer is covering it really nicely I'm again using a revolution fast concealer i don't think this one is available anymore i keep on looking on i have a look on their website and i don't know if this one's actually there anymore 
um, because they have released so many um, concealers since then but this is a really nice one um, again I could be wrong it might be on there and I'm talking rubbish because that's nothing new um, but so I forgot to mention the chrome yeah it's five pounds um, yeah and they come in like four or five different shades which is amazing because that means you have a, you know a nice amount of shades to choose you don't just have red I know they have like um, just like glitter ones and then I think they have like pink and maybe a couple, a couple of other shades I'm not too sure about but yeah here we go so this is um, the finished look for the chrome look I think I've done a bit of a mess I look insane but that's fine we're gonna go with it I want to thank you guys so much for watching listening to my rambles and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day I should be filming something tomorrow so something would be out um but have a great day and i'll see you soon bye guys